What is going on guys? Street Fighter 6. We're going to be looking at the... I'm going to skip this. I already looked at it. We're going to look at the creative player options. We're just kind of like looking through it to see what we got here. See like... Uh, and there's a lot of detail in here. I mean there's just so much you can do here. We're just going to get into that. And... Body size and your reach are all factors in a fight. So check everything carefully. And we're basically gonna, and I will tell you, I like, this creative player is really detailed. The only thing I would say I don't like that much is just the lack of, I mean, this, this is a Street Fighter game. So what I'm saying is basically something that you should expect. But, you know, your character doesn't look super realistic. He looks like a cartoon, but that's that's I'm okay with that because it's Street Fighter. That's what Street Fighter is. It's not realistic looking anyway. So let's go ahead. Now here's the thing: your identity doesn't necessarily have to match your body type. You know, you can say female and have and have, I can say female and still have the same body that he has here. That's kind of what's going on. I can say human. This stuff right here doesn't really mean nothing, to be honest. It doesn't change anything about your fighter. It doesn't change the way they look, nothing. This is just basically just what they, you know, because you can turn it. Ability, I can say male and have footing. this body right Remember here, that. you know. That's just what they're doing in this game. I, a lot of games are doing that now, actually. Okay, so now you got your preset avatars. Let me take a look done. at some of these. Well, you can look over the details later if you want anyway. You got this stuff here. I mean, I don't know. They look realistic enough. I mean, it's, it's okay. You know, they, you know, it's not going to look like a a 2K game or anything like that because these are not real people, but it, it's good. It's, good. it's definitely good enough. I mean, and you can add details to their faces like, you know, we're going to look at some of that. They even have a randomizer on here. You got more of these here. You know, I think a lot of people are going to be creating characters from other games, like maybe like Tekken characters, or some of y'all might even create like pro wrestlers or MMA fighters and stuff. I personally think that's, that's kind of a, what? My goodness, how small is this dude? Put a kid on here, man. Wow. That's pretty much a child. Then you got, you know. Man, you got this old shredded guy who's just got this tatted up guy. The tattoos look pretty decent. I mean, then you got somebody who's more like a non-human, like a robot type deal. So you can, there's a lot you can do with this stuff. Let's go to body Big presets. They also hit back easier. And you hear the guy talking about the advantages that you can have. You got these. You could be pretty dug on shredding on here. You could be like a smaller guy who's not really too muscular. You know, he's just a fighter, but he's not necessarily muscle based. Muscles don't necessarily make you a good fighter in reality, anyway. I mean. You know, you got this short, stocky type guy. So there's a lot you can do there. You got your randomizer. Then you got this here. You can blend faces, man. Look at this. You could take this face and this face. Blend them together. Look at that. It's almost like that, G that Grand Theft Auto created character where you have pants. It's almost like that in a way. So you have that. Okay. Then you got, you know, you got your height. Obviously. What in the world? Are you are you serious, man? This is crazy. My goodness. I didn't know you could do that. That's ridiculous. I, <laughs> what is he, about nine feet? Jeez, boy. And I think it's that body type that I have that's making him look kind of weird like that. If you select a different body type, he probably won't look like that. Let's take a look at that and see, okay. Let's go back to presets, preset bodies. See, if I select this, then it probably won't look as weird. 
I mean, it still definitely looks strange. I mean, I, you know, as you can see, he's short. You can make a short guy with, you know, change the torso, long legs, short torso, <laughs> vice versa, whatever you want to do. Then you got your upper body. Let's see what we got here. See how I'm increasing his upper body mass. So you're kind of balancing out his body. See where he, you know, look at that, man. This is, it's got some serious detail, doesn't it? Got your lower body. Same thing. You know, big legs. Small. I mean, this is, this is very good. I mean, because you can really... It's going to give you the ability to create just about anybody you want. And I, I believe this alone is going to draw a lot of people to buy in this game. Even people who generally aren't even Street Fighter fans, they're going to look at this and say, yeah, I definitely want to get this. I want to take a look at it. As you can see, you got all this stuff here. I'll probably eventually create myself, you know, on here, like, you know, I'll create me. That's what I'm going to create. You got your body hair. Look at this. Hair quality, what? Oh, quantity. Of course. Then you got hair quality. What in the world? That's weird, but... You got hair in different spots. Got your face. Sometimes when you stare at your face long enough, you wonder if that beauty mark's always been there. You now you can adjust any part of the head. Basically take a picture of somebody you're trying to create and just kind of look at them and adjust accordingly. That's basically what you can do on here. One thing I notice about games that are, that are manufactured in Japan, they tend to make large hands that's just they always do that and i'm wondering if you can you could probably do that somewhere on here you know got different hairstyles of course see how many options they give you they should give you a lot i mean this creative this creative character is really good i i definitely i mean there's so much you can do with this it's just it's phenomenal. I, I mean, I kind of wish there was more options than there is, but, you know, I, w I definitely would not complain about it. Man, what's, you got hair settings. What is, oh, hair color setting. You got, okay, color area. Look at all this, man. This is, man, this is, this is in depth. Got your eye shape, you, you know, mouth shape, ears. Facial hair. The facial hair looks definitely looks good enough. I mean, I mean, this game. It seems like, man, you can have a beard that long. My goodness, this game seems like it's gonna be a crap load of fun. I mean, it really does. Let's see, skin. Oh, look at that. Add the age. Look at that. Add your laugh lines. Look at that. You can max everything out here, man. Look at this. Like, skin. Look at this dude. He's... I mean, what if I take the age away and I just add the roughness? What is that going to do for me? The roughness changes the texture. As you can see, look at that. Smoothing it out. Kind of... You know, the rough, rough type guy. Definition. I don't really get what they mean by definition. Oh, okay. They're adding, like, lines on his face. Man, this, there's a lot of detail on here, man. I'm telling you that right now. Got your expressions. I'm not seeing a huge difference in his face, you know. Look, you can... Oh, okay, look 
happy, angry. Look, there's actually a an expression um, attribute or shows what percentage of you know this one is not based on any emotion. This one's based on sadness. This one's more based on surprise. Look at that. Happy, angry. A little bit of happiness and a little bit of anger. 70% happy, 30% angry. That's, that's crazy. I ain't, I've never seen anything like that before. Moving on to this. Yeah, body paint, body, you know. Be sure to take care of the places that can't be seen. Body too. moles. You know. You got, what is this? Face paint, face scar. Face mole, customized face paint. Take a lot of time to decide. Look at or this, man. Throw something on. It's your call. You can do this stuff here. It's like, what, so what skin color? So, okay, yeah, I already looked at it. Body color, body hair color. Yeah, yeah, we already looked at that stuff here. Okay. You got your voices. Let me hear those see. vocal cords. Let's see what you've got. Put on a good show. Let's see what you've got. Let's see what you've got. Let's see how you do. Let's see what you've got. Think you can take me? Don't hold back now. You got the skill? Think you've got what it takes? You better not be all talk. Let us do battle. You got 16 voices. Looks like you got 8 and 8. Let's see what you've got. You know, 8 and 8 as in 8 male, 8 female. It doesn't say that, but okay. Body type you recipe. Where you can what? Save all of your coolness and data form. What? Oh, look at this. So this right here is, you can screenshot this and basically make it so that you know the exact way to create your guy. That is kind of interesting. I and mean, look how much stuff there is, man. Look at all that. You know, so, I, you know, you can do that and, you know, I don't know, I guess send it to somebody, maybe, if they want to see your your recipe if you want to call it that you know so that's what you got here you know let's take a look at randomizer here look at this here and the randomizer works really quick too look at that but let's take a look at females too we're going to take a look at female because i just looked at let's see oh my goodness man Go back to randomizer. What? You got a female with a beard? Are you serious? I guess you can do that on. Well, you can do. Yeah, they they are gonna let you do that on here. But I do, I, hopefully the faces are different based on you know male fe. I mean you know male and female. Hopefully that's the case because. If not, that's like, you know. It looks like it might not be. It looks like, I don't know, man. That kind of looks, you know. Maybe I should stay away from talking about that. But look at those eyebrows, man. They look too, like, they look drawn on or whatever. But, yeah, so there we have it, man. You you got your, but let's let's. I'm gonna take a look at body again, real quick. Let's see. Go to. What's going on here? Okay. Body. You got your presets. Got muscular. But then you go down here. You can do this stuff here. Have somebody completely shredded. Have somebody's overweight but as you can see the body looks kind of so now you can structure where you want their size to be at you know oh my goodness man what in the world well like I said you can do anything basically in this game so create some huge enormous legs you know when it whoops you can lower that stuff back you know and then you can go down here too so this game has some massive detail 
But anyway, that's what we're going. I just wanted to just kind of give a word on this customization because it's it's pretty serious. 